marketer in Oregon, Michael Babcock, here to walk you through the process of getting your Got Backup software installed and set up. Now, I've went ahead and reset everything using GVO and their support team, which is very useful as you can go ahead and delete everything, especially for the purposes of uh, demonstrations. What I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and log into my Got Backup account by going to gogvo.com and clicking on the My Account button. I'm going to go ahead and enter my username and my password to go ahead and log in, and I'll hit Log In. If all you have is the Got Backup product, your back office will look a little bit different. I have more products with GVO than just Got Backup, so I'm going to go ahead and click on the uh, Got Backup link. And that link is labeled GB slash mem underline login. If all you have is the Got Backup product, this should be the page you see when you log in. You'll need to scroll to the My Account section and click on the Got Backup Accounts the first time you log in. And we'll press the Add New Account button. I'll go ahead and fill out this information with my first name my last name, my email address, which I'll put my your own pay email address here, and my password, as well as a confirmation password. Hit the add account button, and you'll be presented with this page. Click on the login button next to the name of the person who you just added. That's probably your name. And you'll be on this page. Scroll down to the Got Backup Desktop Software link and click on that button. So we can find the version of the software that coincides with your version of operating system and get that installed. We'll select the Windows XP Vista 7 slash 8 installation for my copy. And when this dialog comes up, we'll select the Save button. Let that download. And then we'll go ahead and locate the file and start the installation process. It'll go through this process for a couple of moments. My apologies about that a moment ago. You'll select the yes button when the user account dialog comes up and asks if you want to allow got backup access to your computer. When you're on this screen, you'll enter the email address and the password that you set up. And when you've successfully entered your email address and password, you'll be presented with this screen. Now what I did is I just tapped the next button and then finish and the software is set up. I personally didn't select any of those folders. You can if you want. In the next video, I'll show you how to select what folders you want to back up to your computer. If you want to get this amazing and powerful software, visit gb.yourownpay.com.